Sometimes I really imagine I'm living in a ship which is nearby to be drawn. People inside the boat are fighting for survival. Women face domestic violence all over Afghanistan. Women are not allowed to do any social activity, just like prisoners. In the past 40 years, when Afghanistan is passing through the war, of course, this problem has aggravated. It has taken more worse shape than before. We try to empower women. They should understand about their right, and they should a prosperous and dignified life. I was on third grade when the Russian invasion in Afghanistan started and the situation was very bad. From the eighth grade onward, we migrated to Pakistan. That time was a very shocking moment in my life. My other sisters and their children were dying in the camps without food and shelter. We established our center by the name of Noor Educational Center. Noor means light. It was 2002 after the political change, we came back to Kabul. We start our work from literacy program for 2,000 women. Education is very important in Islamic religion. And today we are in condition that we are not allowed to go to school. But Holy Prophet orders us even go to China to seek knowledge. We were facing lots of challenges with religious leaders of the community. Women were not allowed to go to the mosques. For the first time in the history of Afghanistan, we opened two women's sections in two mosques, and now we have the network of imams in 22 provinces. And from 25 people, now it has reached to 6,000 imams. Wakteke ala kamandi wa dinsuziye khanem jamila abhani radidom ma bishtar tar تشویق شدم که باید در ای راه مبارزه علیه خشونت زنان کار کنم. I know it's a long journey ahead. I have lots of things to do. We are human beings and this is our responsibility to struggle. بنی آدم ازای یک دیگرند که در آفیقینش و یک جوهرند چو عضوی به درد آورد روزگار دیگر عضوها را نماند قرار تو کس درد دیگران بیغمی نشاید که نامت نهند آدم Thank you.